Hi, I'm Lynette from PanicAttackRecovery.com. At times, we receive questions from subscribers about mood swings and anxiety. Many people have shared their experiences with us. Some have indicated that moodiness and or irritability can accompany their anxiety. Others have suggested that during certain times of the day, they feel a change in mood for no apparent reason. According to Anxiety and Depression Association of America, some people experience feelings of anxiety or depression or suffer mood swings that are so severe and overwhelming that they interfere with personal relationships, job responsibilities, and daily functioning. These people may be suffering from an anxiety disorder, bipolar disorder, or both. Obviously, if bipolar disorder or any other condition is suspected, it should be discussed with a professional. However, if you aren't already doing so, you might consider observing your mood and anxiety levels in conjunction with daily events. Let me discuss an example. Have you ever worked in a job that requires you to keep a log of completed tasks throughout the day? For example, responding to emails, dealing with phone calls, working on a draft report, or whatever tasks you work on during the day. Then, later, you come back to your log of activities and review what you did earlier in the day. Often your activities may have taken an unexpected turn. That is, often you might discover sources of interruption and other problematic issues that occurred during the day. Since things are documented, they can be much easier to recognize. Similarly, by tracking your moods and thoughts in this manner, you have a reference point to see changes and patterns in your moods throughout the day. This can allow you to discover certain thoughts and situations that might be triggering your moodiness and anxiety. You may not always see patterns in your emotions when you don't keep track of things. However, if you isolate your thoughts, you can see how certain events and your thinking can be influencing your anxiety and mood. A simple activity such as journaling might be incredibly helpful for you. For instance, Benjamin Hardy, in his article, Journaling Can Change Your Life, recommends journaling every day. His article suggests that journaling can improve creativity and help with learning and emotional help. The general recommendation with this type of journaling is that you shouldn't worry about making writing or spelling mistakes. Just write freely. The idea is that you would keep the material private so that you're not inhibiting the process. Many people have reported to us that they found journaling to be a useful way to track how they are feeling throughout the day. This can allow one to note what one was doing when the feeling and thoughts occurred and then see if there are particular triggers. We're not suggesting you'll completely eliminate all mood swings and anxiety. Rather, you might be able to eliminate unnecessary triggers in your environment and unhealthy thoughts, and then perhaps generate a helpful strategy to deal with such things in the future. For more information about strategies that will help with your mood and anxiety, you can also visit our website and sign up for our free newsletter. Please also don't forget to subscribe to Panic Attack Recovery on YouTube and follow us on Twitter and Facebook. If you'd like to see a video on a particular topic, please let us know in comments below.